Hi everybody, um, <clears throat> what I'm going to try and do today, because I'm still, well I'm still in lockdown, I'm still stuck in LA by, I've been here for too long now, I'm getting fed up, I can't do any real guitars, uh, I've been sorting out and I, I've got some scrap stuff, uh, I'm going to try and make a guitar out of the, the scrap I've got. I've got that. I haven't got any boxes, I've got two innards from some of the boxes. And this one. Another piece of scrap. Okay, take two, let's start again. Hi everybody, um, still stuck here with this lockdown, I've got no boxes um, to make any guitars, I certainly haven't got the room really to make any guitars but I want to do something. I've been sorting out the rubbish, been throwing bits of rubbish away and uh, I've come across some stuff that I was uh, going to well basically throw away because I, I replaced a top on my chicken bone john guitar and this is what's come off it and um, this is something for a project that I uh, I made at one time and another but uh, never used it and I've got uh, two of the inner frames from the some cigar boxes so I'm going to try and utilise them and make a guitar. I'm going to have to use a decent neck of, of some sort. I don't know if it's going to be a, a two string, a three string or what. I don't know, but the the only thing I will use that is 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 uh, of decent quality will be some wood for the neck. Otherwise, it would be a waste of time making it. So working off the top of my head, this is now a quick plan is I'm going to see if I can use utilize one of these and these holes here I'm going to try and incorporate into the corners of the box to make a sound hole yeah so basically it would be it'd be something like that so I can actually use them two holes one way or another as half a sound hole if you understand me yeah it's just so I'm just experimenting so, so I'm not going to waste anything if I can so this will be cut off as a lid and that will be a moon shaped sound hole uh, I don't know about these they're just going to have to stay I might try and drop a coin in or something but I've got a feeling I'm going to have to cut them in half as well so I might even uh, see about making them into little sound holes as well and there's a hole right through the center there i'm not going to fill it uh, i'm not sure what i'm going to do if i'm going to put a piezo in i might actually put a piezo on the underside of that and um well we'll see anyway we'll, we'll see so that, that's that's the idea is doing that with the with one of these i don't know which one yet and using that piece of wood as the back of the box. Uh, we'll just have to see what goes. Well, that's that's a general idea. So I'm going to see which one. I think the longer one would be the better one, um, just to give me more surface area to work on. So I'll just have a quick look now. I'll try and centre the picture as much as I can. It's, uh, it's got to be awkward, isn't it? So if I was to, to do that, man, yeah, I could, I could make a, a bigger hole at the bottom or or at the top, and a half a moon at the at the other end, can't I? I don't have to. Uh, <coughs> I don't have to make it symmetrical.
So if, if I if I do it sort of like that, I don't know if you see that on the on the picture. Um, right into the corners there. I I won't I won't have a weak spot then in the corner, will I? It's not going to look very pretty, but who cares? Rather than waste a wood and sit here twiggling my fingers, well, I want to do something. I'm going to go with that, I think. Possibly do the same with the shorter one. Let's have a, a look. Got an idea there. So if I did, use the short, the smaller box, I can um, <coughs> create the sound holes slightly different like that but then it would give me more of this that I have to contend with there Oops, again I say it's not really an issue so I quite like that idea of having that sound all like that really so that would be cut away So that's quite nice. Quite a nice idea. Okay, let's uh, let's have a look at it. Let's put it on top of let's put it on top of a guitar. To give us a, a bit of an idea what it'd look like. I know what I'm looking at, I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to do there. Uh, just get a visual of what the guitar would look like with the small box on them holes against the neck. There's only one way to find out, isn't there? Let's do it. So, I don't know which to go for. I don't have to go for that or the longer one. Do the same thing with the longer one, but that would have the uh, the pitch is slightly uh, off centre. See, that still looks good. In fact, I like that. In fact, I like that. No, I don't think that looks as good. I think that looks better. I'll take that to the back. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for that. I'm gonna go for it being a bit like that. I'm going to go for something like that, so let's have a look. So we've got uh, maybe three quarters of an inch, isn't it? So let's, uh, let's do three quarters of an inch there, see what that looks like there. Twenty-two centimeters, uh, millimeters. 
that's 22 millimeters so if we set it about there Twenty two, twenty two. So if we set that that position, Okay, so that's going to be the box where the markings are. That's going to be the top of the box. And then we're um, once I've cut this, we decide if to make these into little uh, little sound holes as well, which probably would be better than trying to fill it. So that's that bit sorted out, and obviously the bottom of the box, which is. <coughs> Which, as luck would have it, is actually spot on. That has obviously come off a box that was the same diameter as that, but uh, a longer one. In fact, I know which it was. I bought it off eBay. So one that fell to pieces on me at eBay, off eBay. Oh, the crap that was and all. So there we go. We're going to, that's a bit of waste. That's a bit of waste. That's a bit of waste. That was all going to go in the bin this morning. I'm becoming a bit of a hoarder now with things like this for the guitars. I have got two necks, which I uh, I've got two necks here. I marked them out. Funny enough, yesterday, one for a uh, twenty-five and a half inch scale, and one for twenty-four and a three three quarter inch scale there was um there was a split in these bits of wood at the end I got I got this virtually for, for nothing really the wood had been split and uh, I've glued it you can see that one is a bit better there you can see the split in the wood there um, but it'd be okay Okay, be used so I'll be able to use one of them. Okay, speak to you in a bit. <laughs> 